interior was designed to resemble the Ritz Hotel in London. If the interior of the Titanic looks familiar, it's because it was modeled after London's Ritz Hotel. A contemporary style included dining rooms with ornate ceilings and plush carpets as well as first-class cabins designed after some of the suites at the Ritz. The captain may have been close to retirement. According to some reports, Titanic Captain Edward John Smith may have been set to retire after this final voyage. Many people are torn about Captain Smith, some say he was responsible for one of the worst disasters of all time based on his negligence, while others call him a hero, as he bravely went down with the ship. The Titanic featured a heated saltwater swimming pool on deck. The Titanic had a heated saltwater swimming pool on deck, a rarity for a luxury ocean liner at the time. It also featured Turkish baths, a squash court, and a library. At least one worker died while building the Titanic. In 1910, 15-year-old Samuel Scott, the first casualty of the Titanic, fell from a ladder and died due to a fatal skull fracture. His body was buried in an unmarked grave in Belfast, finally receiving a headstone in 2011. Scott wasn't alone, as builder James Dobbins was crushed under lumber during the transport of the ship to a dock. Other deaths were also rumored to have occurred during the construction, which allegedly involved other young and unskilled workers and shoddy oversight. Only around 340 bodies were located. Experts are divided about whether there are still human remains aboard the wreckage of the Titanic at the bottom of the ocean. Searchers have only recovered 340 bodies since the Titanic sank, leaving 1160 still lost at sea. The boat delivered mail. Though the RMS Titanic was, by designation, a royal merchant ship, it also carried carried mail under the auspices of His Majesty's postal authorities. It is said the ship was carrying 3,500 bags of mail, and over 7 million pieces of mail were lost when it sank. It was a closer rescue ship. Although the Carpathia eventually came to the Titanic's rescue, there was a closer ship that would have been more ideal for a rescue mission. Californian and her captain, Stanley Lord, were stuck in an ice field themselves and tried warning other ships. Allegedly, the Titanic told them to shut up. Officers on the Californian eventually saw the flare signals from the Titanic, but dismissed them as friendly signals between ships in the same company. The Titanic had its own daily newspaper. The Titanic featured its own newspaper, called the Atlantic Daily Bulletin. The paper was printed each day on board the Titanic. It included news and society gossip, horse racing results, and stock prices. Three dogs made it onto the lifeboats. Although nine dogs passed away aboard the Titanic, three lucky pups somehow made it onto a lifeboat, two Pomeranians and one Pekingese. One of the dogs that survived belonged to Harper and Row Publishing heir Henry Harper. When asked why he saved his dog over other people, he replied, there seemed to be lots of room, and nobody made any objection. All of the third-class passengers shared two bathtubs. The third-class accommodations on the ship were, needless to say, less glamorous than those in first class. The third class bunk beds included mattresses, 
blankets, and pillows. They lacked sheets and pillowcases. And only two bathtubs served all 700 plus third class passengers. Can you imagine waiting your turn to take a bath at the end of a 450 person line? A handwritten letter from the day of the accident still exists. After over 100 years, the last surviving handwritten letter composed on Titanic letterhead resurfaced for an auction. Esther Hart and her daughter, Eva, wrote a letter to Esther's mother about the wonderful journey they were taking together on the Titanic. Although her husband was tragically killed that day, Esther and Eva survived. They kept the letter in the family for decades, until it went up for auction in England and sold for around zero in 2014. On the morning of the accident, a lifeboat drill was cancelled. The lifeboat situation was pretty dire when the Titanic went sank. Some boats left early, with room for more passengers on board, due to extreme panic and confusion. This could have been avoided if the scheduled lifeboat drill for that morning had not been cancelled. It remains unclear clear why the drill was cancelled. Hey guys, thank you so much for the support and likes and comments down below and also thank you so much for watching and I look forward to see you in the next video then. Take care. Bye.